there are a few things that are different uh, since the last time, well, last time if you haven't played since Legion. Since Legion, you'll notice the guards here are, again, the um, Silver Covenant are back. They're no longer um, the, um, they're, only Gil they're no longer Worgen. They're no longer Gilneans. So, before we go find Dagda and Bran, Magnus not going anywhere. So a lot is the same. Uh, the great stem attack is there. I'm gonna see if this bug is still here, because this is wild. Um, now, if you played a rogue during Legion, you know what's down here. So, you talk to Red Jack Mindle. You don't Looking get this unless you have. Specific. Lay your insignia on the table. Be careful. Now, they may have taken it out. Do you see that? What's going on? Now, if you look at the, the buff you have on, disguise, your disguise is a member of the Uncrowned. I'm literally a member of the Uncrowned. <laughs> but anyway, um, time displaced veil, protected from causing further ripples in the timeline. What? Now, you go down here, and then you get here, and you can't go any further. You're stuck here. But I want you to notice something. If you hover over this, you, it looks like a little portal here. Yes, it does look like a time portal. Um, time portal to everywhere in. Now, you may be thinking, like me, I did every Ian's fringe quest. Can't sit down. I did every Ian's fringe quest. I don't remember this one. And also, it's clearly not supposed to be doing this in the middle of this quest. What's going on? So we're going to take a short detour. Um, there are other ways to get over there. Oh! Suddenly I have Vanessa Van Cleef with me. Um, maybe she was with me the whole time. She'll be yelling every once in a while. Uh, so yeah. Peculiar, right? I wonder what will happen if we go the everywhere in in uh, Beldrassus. And take the portal. Where it will send me. Why do we do that? Now. Oh. <laughs> it happens to be Anduin's day. Hey, Andy. <laughs> so Anduin's day. Now. His quest in this doesn't involve a portal. You'll notice immediately, look at the bottom, bottom right, time portal to Hall of Shadows. That's the Rogue Order Hall in Dalaran. So the portal's on this side too. But, you know, this Anduin, this is when you get to have to find his missing Hearthstone card, and then he tells you, you know, he's like, I'm going to remember this forever, and you're like, no, <laughs> forget all about it. Um, but anyway, it's Andy Day here too. So when you click on it, because why not? I'm hoping it puts me on. Okay. Yes. So, you end up on the other side. Now, there's nothing you can do here. There's a wall here. But you can go in this direction. Amber Kiernan. Also Amber Kiernan. Now, when the Ian's Friends Quest were on the PTR, there was two quests that upset people. Um, one was the Alex Chazza quest. I'm not going to go into that. I'm glad with the changes they made. I'd rather be the person that makes the good thing happen than makes the bad thing happen. The other quest was this one. Now, if you've never played a rogue, you're probably indifferent to this. But if you've played a rogue, and you've played that rogue through Miss of Pandaria, which I believe may be the first time you see Amber Kiernan. She's part of the team of three, along with Rel Nightwind and, um... Oh! Sully, the Pickle, McCleary. 
Um, so um, so she's the she's the sharpshooter. So that's pretty much the first time you really have very much interaction with her. I forget if she was in earlier expansions, but she definitely was there. And um, you know, she was in your garrison and what? And in Legion, she turns up murdered, and you have to actually investigate, and you uncover the whole plot with dreadlords and and Matthias being a dreadlord, and and or by the someone impersonating Matthias being a dreadlord. Matthias is perfectly fine now. Um, and you investigate that, and you know, as a rogue, this is like you know a character. If you played you know the games as a rogue this whole time, it's like a character you know, you know, SI seven agent. Um, You've encountered her a lot. You've you've been through expansions with her a lot. It's, you know, and you help solve her murder. But it's a rather sad and upsetting event that you know, she died. Um, you know, it's a you know, an NPC, minor NPC character death, but still, it's one that you know your character on Alliance at least would have history with. Um, if your character was a rogue, even more history with. Uh, right now, this would be like, oh, oh, damn. However, this is not from Legion. This is from Dragonflight. So, as far as you know, this isn't supposed to be here. <laughs> this quest was taken out of the game. It was put back in with the patch for the pre-patch. And I think what it was was there's a loop that was not closed. Somewhere in the code. I am not a programmer. I'm not a developer, but my guess is something like they were able to shut something off and then it wouldn't appear like they didn't have to close. Like there's a loop that was left open. And what that did was put this quest unfinished back into the game. So you can't start it. So I think they turned, they shut off the start. They didn't shut off the, they may have shut off the completion, but what they didn't shut off was everything in between again. Not a programmer. Not sure how it works. But it did start showing up then. Because I had brought a rogue in here fairly recently. Like just last month. So it was definitely the last patch. And a lot of people have been reporting that. Um, what sucks though. And how I first discovered it myself. I wasn't the only person to discover it. But the, when I first stumbled upon it myself. And I hadn't read about it anywhere else. Was it was a completely new rogue. Um, and I was like. Ah, well, since I'm here why don't I start. You know the Legion quest line, get her into the Hall of Shadows. And I encountered the wall on the other side, just like when I started this. And I was like, what the hell? And I was like, okay, well, let me let me go in on Arleia. And I went in on Arleia, and I was like, wait. <laughs> it's not supposed to be doing this. And I was like, okay, let me take this portal then. And I took it back, and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> what is going on <laughs> and yeah part of the quest is still in and when I mean part of the quest is still in I mean hello Amber shifts in defensive position so you're an uncrowned peacekeeper I'm here with an urgent message from Lord Jurak Ravenholt and you have a choice yes I'm with the uncrowned or assassinate Amber Kiernan we're gonna we're gonna take our time doing this. Amber visibly relaxes. Excellent. Please take me to your leaders. There is something happening in SI seven. I think it's been infiltrated. I have assassins after me, so I appreciate I so I'd appreciate an escort. Amber throws you a small smile. Assassinate Amber Kiernan is your choice, or you as a shadow blade. Your actions here will lead to the end of the Legion. Amber raises an eyebrow. But her smile remains. Thank you. I hope so. And then your only choice is assassinate Amber Kiernan. Or goodbye. But if you assassinate her, you'll you'll notice there's she's holding a letter here. She's also on the ground. The corpse is there. I think you could talk to both of them, but we'll see what happens, because watch. Assassinate Amber Kiernan. Boink. She pops back up 
And What's you can do it over agent? again and over again, and you're in a time loop. But I'm going to actually click on the bottom. Amber Kiernan lies dead at your feet, your dagger sticking out of her back. Well, I'm all timey-wimey, but you see it. So... And you can keep doing that forever and ever and ever. Now, if you go try to go back up the stairs, you're now on the other side of that invisible wall, but the wall is still there. You can't get through it. The only way out of this is to, you know, just hearth back in. Like using the Dalaran Hearthstone will get you there. But yeah, um, interesting, huh? So this is a quest that was cut because, well, I mean, for rogues especially, it's painful. You don't want to find out you're the one who killed Amber Kiernan. After all these years of solving her murder, which apparently you didn't. Because <laughs> it was you. It's a little messed up. Now, it doesn't mean that I don't support the risk being taken here. But just like the other changes made to Ian Fringe's quest, such as punching Ravi in the face as a kid, um, glad they changed that. Now you just pay his tap, which is actually a lot funnier. Uh, being the one who gets Alex Straza something um, versus the improvement, which is you know, like making sure she's rescued, the something still happens, but you're at least doing a good thing in this scenario. But this one, I don't think they could have tweaked it in any way. It's like, if the whole point was you're now assassinating him, you were the one who assassinated Amber Kiernan the whole time, how do you rewrite that? Because that's, that's the catch, is you were the one who did it. That is the story. Uh, but I appreciate the risk being taken here. And we do get to see it. Um, somewhat. <laughs> There's more, I think, to this quest than that's here, but this is the part that's still in the game. Um, I'm stuck here. What really sucks, though, is that it's bugged out... Uncrowned Peacekeeper, is that it's um, it's bugged out for people who haven't done the road quest line in Legion yet. So they can't do it. It can't be completed. So yes, as fun as this is and entertaining as this is, um, it should be fixed. But in the meantime... Yes, Agent. Point. It's not that, like she even phases in. She just stands right back up. Um, it's I feel terrible, and I'm not going to keep doing that. But I'm just pointing out that it's clearly bugged. Um, but you actually do get to see it. So if you're curious, now might be the time. It is fun. I I do have things the father on. I all my rogues do. So I don't know. <laughs> If you just have those naturally or not. Um, I'm not going to go through the trouble of changing my appearance. I'll check it on my own time and see. So the only way to really get out of this is to uh, just hearth back into Dalaran. You're in Dalaran. Just doesn't tell you you're already in Dalaran. We got a time on. Let's get on time. So, pretty much everything else is the same. I do want to stop in here. Because Dog is here. And I say hello to Dog. And I'm looking at you, Blizz, because if you do anything to Dog, I will be very upset. <laughs> Dog is from Pandaria. You cannot get him in Remix. But he will follow you. If you get him in Pandaria for your farm, because you can't get the farm, that's why you can't get him in, in Remix, because you don't have access to the farm. 
if you get him for the farm, he will show up in your garrison. And then there's a quest in Legion to get him to show up here. Um, dog's coat is gleaming and it looks quite healthy. Brianni, Brianni is clearly taking very good care of it. But how did he get here? Now if you pet dog, your dog pushes its head under your hand. If you love dog, your dog loves you too. Liz, I've heard I've heard good news about it. I'm just saying, nothing better happened to dog. Okay, okay. Um, if you have dog in your garrison, the quest to get it involves looking for little pebbles all around the ground. They're really hard to see, but I don't think I can see it on her now because she's already did the quest. So yes, what I want to show you is there are Sun Reavers are now back to guarding, guarding the Horde section of town. Um, there might be some new random people wandering around. Um, I think there's an entrance to the upstairs here, to the what you would call it. I thought there was an entrance. Right. Let's see if there's an interest in the G-Show. Oh, there it is. It's right here. Oh, you can't even click on the door knocker. There's several ways into the Rogue's Order Hall. Apparently this is one of them. I've been in this one. But you can't click on the door knocker. Alright. Um, I'm gonna go here. See if anyone new is here. No, Roscoe's still there. Old Toomba is still there. Same old folks. No one knew. Bogrim. Brandon Buffbeard. Yep, they're all here. Punchy Lou. <laughs> That's a dog. I was about to get. And. So. Nothing really changes there. Now, I forget if Greg Stoutbeard is just standing in the hallway? He's standing in the, the doorway? Normally in the Broken Isles down the end? Um, because I thought that was a little odd, but it may just be I, I never noticed because I always went in this way. <laughs> Maybe? Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Nothing's going on over here. Don't worry, there's a point to this. I, I'm, I'm not just wandering around because everything's exactly the same. There was something different that stood out. Um, when I was just running around and it's right over here. Look who's here. Tuberose. Renan. Toddy. And, um, I forget who she, um, Theresa. I don't remember her. <laughs> Sorry. And over here we got Lupus Lightsprocket, Reno Jackson, Elise Starseeker, and Sir Finley Mergleton. So, yeah. Um, I looked to see if the reliquary was anywhere nearby, but I didn't see them. Uh, sorry, there's a dwarf with a top hat at pulling Brawler Bur Beardington, and I, I have to respect that. So, let's talk to who we can talk to, Sir Mergleton. I must say, I'm rather excited about this new adventure, though I understand it has quite the dodgy history, doesn't it? No one's quite sure what the Earthen were truly getting up to there. All right. You're probably going like, wait, you know about the Earthen? This is the pre-patch. Yeah, by the way. This dialogue probably shouldn't be here yet. Worried about the dangers lurking within Kalzalgar? Don't be. After all, you, you have the amazing Reno Jackson watching your back. 
we're not remember we don't know where we're supposed to go magni hasn't told us yet and he doesn't tell us at the end of this either but they know <laughs> Just, just walk right through, it's cool. Um, salutations, hero. I must admit, I'm quite excited to see Kazelgar. There's so much to explore there. May the stars guide you. We don't you. know about it yet. Hey, Daddy. Go first, but I've got a story after. A lot of folks think of modern day Earth and as dwarven ancestors. But that's not quite right. More like cousins? Still, we're all family, and I'm as excited as a whelp with a ducky for a possible reunion. So, probably a call back to Lila Straza, the whelpling that had um, a, a happy duck, and then you got lucky duck as a result that you had to repair her ducky toy, and she was very, very happy. So I'm guessing that's a call back to that, which I appreciate. Um, but again, Earthen, Kazelgar. We're not supposed to know that yet. Because Magni is supposed to tell us about that. And Magni is unconscious. See you at the next adventure. Baladash Malinore. Hmm? Oh, yes. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Everyone seems on edge, don't you think? Can't possibly think why. Oh, right. The horrible visions of destruction. The entire reason Dalaran is teleporting to Kazagar. I remember now. I'm not going to elaborate on that. If you know, you know. Um, All right. See but you later. there are visions of destruction, apparently. I haven't seen any visions of destruction. Have you? <sighs> So is that something that's coming up? Uh, Chibros doesn't talk to you. But he's an entrepreneur of shiny things. And also you'll notice if you hover over them, they're part of the Algari expedition. They're not the... Um... Well, they're still... Reno Jackson and Elise Starseeker, and then they're still the Explorers League. But uh, Renan and Toddy are all part of the... Uh... Well, it says Dragon Scale Expedition, but the Algari Expedition. So, so they're both, I guess. Um, yeah, old Toddy. Um, I do not see uh, the. Um, I don't see Nalidra, Nalida, the uh, the reliquary. You know, the one who referred to Kadgar as that handsome wizard. Uh, but. Kelly goes, weren't you quitting? <laughs> Why are you here? So Kelly goes is here. The blue dragon flight stands with you. Good to see you, friend. Remember good, good your to duty to Azeroth. Good, good to see you too. You're not supposed to be here. Uh, Madeira. King's honor, friend. Hell champion. Go with um, honor, friend. And Archmage and Sir Rumi were just hanging, chilling there. So there's that. Stuff that's not supposed to be there. I think she can actually play. Hello. Do you share a tale from the past or lay it? Yes, I would, but you don't have I don't have an option to listen to it. I think up here though you do get access to the I should have completed this. Oh, hey Chromie. Deaths of Chromie. Yes, I've done Death of Chromie, thank you very much. Um but here Robert Newhearth. Need help? Um, you can watch the, the, you know, those, those like stop motion comic book, I forget what they're officially called, um, animations. You've got the Illidan one, the Gul'dan one, the Khadgar one. So Light those are all you. accessible from here. If you're curious, if you're in the area, does he have some? He might have some. No, he does not. Archmage Landalock. So if you're in the neighborhood and... Mm -hmm want to see why the heck Kelly Ghost is still here when he's not supposed to be. So yeah, let's go back in. 
Um, I did not see any of the reliquary, at least I can talk to, um, anywhere. But yeah, so those are the only changes I was able to see.